My name is Ayala Naftali and I work in sterling silver, coconut shell and other mixed materials. I do jewelry with a lot of different materials. Most of them are natural materials that I'm dyeing for the color and the texture. But primarily I'm a silversmith with these materials being the focus of the color part of my work, but I'm a metalsmith. So uh, most of the work is silver, but I'm adding a lot of other materials to give it color and texture. I started off in college, I did anodized aluminum where you got to color the metal, but it was a kind of toxic process. And I wanted to be able to do that without the toxicity of it. And I also wanted something that was not fragile, so I didn't want to do enamels. And um, I did some stained wood, and then it sort of branched into this coconut shell, which had this incredible texture. And so each piece has its own grain. And, and then on some of the pieces, I'm burning the surface, so I'm getting even more of the grain out of it. I really love to push the boundaries of every material. Like, what can I do with it? Can I bend it? Can I break it? Can I burn it? And how does it look when you, you know, flip it on the other side? What does the side grain look like? So I really do, with every new material that comes into my world, I kind of push it in every direction and see where I can take it. There is a lot of inspiration from my cultural background and my family's from uh, Israel and Greece. And there, everyone, every time I'm over there, I find like I come back incredibly inspired by ancient and contemporary. I mean, there's like amazing, contemporary architecture and art and then there's you know absolutely like primitive you know tools that you'll find in like Jerusalem and those all inspire me and so th that's something that is definitely part of my inspiration. I spend a lot of time on the wearability of my work and that's really important to me and so when I design an earring there's a lot of my time is spent on the functionality of it so the design is super important, but equally important, I feel like I'm in, in the functional art world, that those things need to function. They need to function when you're dancing, and they need to function when you're, you know, you should be able to wear it all day. It should be light, it should be comfortable. So it, that functionality is a parameter that I actually really like the challenge of. And, you know, if not, then I would just make sculpture, and I wouldn't have to do all those things. But I actually like those parameters, and so, you know, if you buy a piece of work for me, it's going to function. And if it doesn't, I want to know about it.